Victoria Stewart and I'm here at the American Humane Association's Hero Dog Awards. We all know that our companion dogs go above and beyond for us. They're the hero dogs in our lives, but these dogs are really special. I'm an ambassador for the American Humane Association, very proud to be so, but I'm also being a judge for tonight's award. So I'm really hoping the dog that I picked wins. I have the pleasure of being escorted by military working dog, Loop Mike 560. My dog spent a year in Iraq as a combat tracker, and the explosive detection dog went in first to find the IED, and then Luke and his handler would come in, then track the bad guy who had planted the IED. So it was a very perilous job, because they would be tracking him into villages and that kind of thing. And I'm thrilled, because I'm under no illusions as to where the big deal is. It's on that end of the leash. Gabe is, he's the uh, Military Hero Dog of the Year. He had uh, 210 combat missions in Iraq. He had 26 finds of explosives and weapons. And uh, you know, now we're just trying to be that voice out there to keep supporting war dogs, because they do amazing things. Gabe is, you know, just one of thousands just doing amazing things. This is Chica Marie. She's representing the Sage Foundation for Dogs Who Serve. The Sage Foundation helps support from, through medical funding search and rescue police and military dogs that a lot of times they become ill, too old to work, or injured and help fund for the medical care. We're kind of a retirement plan for, for working hero dogs. I hope you've enjoyed the Hero Dog Awards tonight. I'm Victoria Stowell for eHealth Pets.